y'all how prime drivers disconnect their trailers at a shipper or a receiver. Either you can start from the top of the trailer, you can start from the glad hand, go to your release pin, and then go to landing gear. But I'm gonna start from the landing gear on up. So it's like one, two, three. Cut it down until both legs hit the ground. It was this one guy that I saw at a receiver and he let he let his legs down. But you see how I'm just looking at one side, but most people neglect to make sure that both legs come down. And what happened with him was he thought that both legs came down when only just the one he was looking at came down. So after he disconnected everything, he got in his truck and pulled off. That trailer on that right hand passenger side came crashing down and he was in for a whole day of bull crap. Being out here any day can become bull crap just that quick and easy. All right, pull my release pin on my fifth wheel. About to pull my Calibrate airline. Hook that up. Gotta pull my electrical line, my brake lights, if I can get it out. Sometimes it's a pain. Then I'm about to pull my service brake line. Ugh. A lot of times you gotta check these seals. These seals ain't like these bad boys and it's quick. That's my APU here running. Sound like a reefer, but APU. So, I got all that stuff. Make sure that both legs are down. And it looks like, it looks like it is. I always remember, don't drop a trailer if your fuel is not either three quarters or full. And you always gotta make sure the inside is clean as well. It have gloves on too. Most guys don't care, but bump that. I'm a female, I like being clean. Now I'm getting inside my truck. Gotta get inside. Now I gotta find trailer number, I don't know if y'all see that, 163022. I gotta put my little code in. I can't show y'all that. Y'all might try to steal my truck one day. Can't have it. The third one. You hear that sound? You gotta sit a little second, you know, to let the air go down. And once it go down, it makes it a, the pressure a little better to pull off. You don't mess up airbags and everything like that. Release just my tractor brake. Connect all the glad hands so I'm not connected to a trailer no more. Forward drive. Just pull forward. 